Bye guys. Well this is the SK Forty Taper that I picked up recently. It's a 27mm spigot that suits the Iskar Pace Mill that I picked up previously. And this is the locking bolt that, that came with it. And um, I've got a couple of uh, 40 tapers that have got this type of key bolt I should say um, but I've not got a key that enables me to tighten this down um, so what I've done to get this one up and running I've put a large washer in the centre and then put a Allen Eddy bolt which is the correct thread and tighten that down onto the washer and I've used this and it's uh, it's not come loose I've not put any thread lock on it which was thought I might do but I haven't done so far so I've been looking around the shop and see if I've got anything suitable that I could make a, a spanner to suit this so what I've come up with I've got this piece now originally this was part of the party taper You can see where I've cut it up, and uh, I've adapted a. I think it was a ER32 collet chuck to uh, use on my wood lathe. So this this piece is a piece that I've cut up. Now looking at that, uh, the top end's 16 millimeters, but it's got one of these pull studs on that came with it. So if I turn it up I could get a spanner on onto those two flats. And the opposite end is just about wide enough to machine that down. Let me take this off. It is wide enough to machine that down to uh, to fit onto this bolt. So, so what I'll do first, I'll mount that into the lathe, I can put this uh, stud back on. Put that then into the choke, and then first of all turn that diameter down um, to the width of that cross section. And then look at machining the the uh, four cutouts that will then slide on. Well, that's one of the pull studs that uh, came with the forty tapers. For a CNC machine, there are six, 16 mil thread on them, which suits the drawbar on my other machines. I've uh, been slowly swapping over from the five eights, the older ones that I first acquired, onto the 16 mil. Just uh, saves me having to change the drawbar over, um, and that's how they come at the top. The one that I've got mounted into this, I'd. Uh, I've cut this top section off uh, to mount it into a chuck to do some machining on this uh, but it's just re reduced the length of it slightly so I've mounted another one up I've got quite a lot of these I've mounted another one up in the chuck and instead of cutting the uh, the top off I'm going to machine it down so it's it's parallel with this section I just thought that might be a give me a bit more grip when I come to put it into a a collet chuck so I've got one mounted in the chuck now I'm just going to turn that down
Life is hard, and so am I. You better give me something so I don't die. Life is fucking real